Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo here with another great Class B Plus motorhome value from Parkway RV Center. Just got in this good looking 2005 Gulfstream B Touring Cruiser. That is in the best selling Class B Plus of all time. It is a 290 model number, 5290 to be exact. Uh, got two slide outs in great shape. Does include a new awning canvas. It, it's got a torn awning canvas, but overlook that that's going to be brand new so you don't have to worry about a half rotted on in canvas nice rig it's got 51,000 miles folks ford chassis on the 450 uh, e450 chassis got the wider wheelbase greater stability and the 290 is the smallest bt cruiser you can get or b touring cruiser excuse me the smallest b touring cruiser you can get with ford's 208 inch uh wheelbase Anything smaller than this comes with the 196, and I do prefer the 208 because great less, especially if you do a lot of interstate driving, a lot less sway um, and a lot more stability, especially if you're towing a runabout behind it. And if you go any smaller than this, you lose that 208 wheelbase. But you can see the outside to be a 14-year-old motorhome is actually in very nice condition. Now, it's got a few little stripes. Um, Looking around on this side, everything looks great for a 2005 model. But you get here on the back, folks, it does have some crow's feet in the in the uh, in the stripes. A little bit of fade on the back, so obviously got some up top up there too. So obviously, however they kept this thing when they weren't using it, I don't think the back end was covered up. Got a 4KW Generac with 475 hours on it. Which is just perp, which is just about the right amount of hours for the miles on the motorhome. Runs great. I've had it running out here for a little while. The roof air is cold. One thing I love about the B Touring Cruiser, it's got a fiberglass roof, so you don't have to worry about a roof uh, having a bad roof like you do on older motorhomes with a rubber roof. DSI water heater. BF Goodrich tires that look great. Like I said, it's going to have a brand new awning canvas. You don't have to worry about that. I like the fact that both slide outs are on the same size so you can get into state parks and older campgrounds that may have tight, narrow spaces. You don't have to have slide outs on both sides. Got the power step that works great. Let's look inside. Folks, everything's original in this motorhome. I like this. It's got the original carpet, original linoleum, original upholstery. Nothing's been changed. Doesn't look like anything's been modified. It does have a satellite, some kind of satellite system on the roof. I haven't really checked into it much, but it's got some kind of satellite. Got the Corian countertops. Table booth and sofa make beds. Flat screen TV. Got the surround sound speakers. And I'm going to show you something, folks. You're going to find in very few of these and none of them in this price range. I'm going to see if I can reach down here and show it to you. It does have the very expensive optional HWH hydraulic leveling jacks. So you can just stand right here or stay or sit right here in the driver's seat, level your RV up when you get to the campground. 51,152 miles. Dash air is ice cold, got the wood grain kit. Um, plastic looks good. We're done, uh, got the cruise control built into the steering wheel like all Fords do. Dash, windshield, power mirrors. Power locks, heated power mirrors, of course. Leather captain's chairs in the front. They're both in great shape. Got the cab over entertainment center. Again, flat screen TV. A uh, little DVD player. Leather sleeper sofa. Table booth makes a bed. These make two separate beds. So you've got just enough room to walk between them. You've got a factory brochure, which I'm going to have on the website, plus you've got the books and manuals that are also included. Day-night shades. A lot of the uh, lights have been changed with LEDs. Fantastic vent fan. Got the padded headliner. This is a multi-layer roof system with a fiberglass top. Got a Corian countertops. Looks great. Now, it's got one stress crack right here, and this is probably what, happened, what happens with a lot of these. These stovetop covers are very heavy. Chances are somebody did what I'm always careful not to do. 
and they probably dropped this and it busted it probably been that way for years it's not going to hurt the functionality so the of course that means you're getting a 29.9 rv with a with a crack on one of the stovetop covers not going to hurt a thing it'll still be usable for years you just have to be very very careful with these uh corian stovetop covers because they are known to crack stovetop looks great microwave confection oven um Residential style faucet. Got a Dometic RB refrigerator freezer that's actually very nice condition and it's actually starting to get cool. Uh, you know, I normally don't have a chance to run these long enough for them to get cold, but you know what? This one should show up on my thermometer. Now, it's not at operating temp yet. Definitely, uh, you can tell it's working because it's 55 degrees in here and it's 90 degrees outside. So definitely, that we know that works and if I left this thing on for several hours with the generator running, of course it's gonna get cold. Pantry, a, a, with adjustable shelves. Privacy curtain. Got the cozy rear bedroom with a slide out with a queen island bed, east-west bed at the foot of the bed. I, I like this floor plan because you get all this storage. Closets, chest of drawers, you got a TV, um, and a nice open bathroom. You got to keep in mind, folks, 20 or 30 feet is not that big of an RV to some people, and especially not to me. I'm used to driving ones a lot bigger than this. But you got a glass-in shower, private water closet, with a um, medicine cabinet, another another nice vent fan, a uh, big sink area, and it does have the heated holding tank, so it is a Four Seasons model. So for those of you wanting to do some winter camping up north, this is one you can do it in. Anyway, folks, this thing's a bargain. It really is. Low miles, hydraulic leveling jacks which if you if you've got a B touring cruiser and you wanted to add those jacks to your current B touring cruiser you're going to spend five or six thousand dollars doing that this has already got it satellite systems probably another thousand dollars you don't have to worry about that either 29.9 that includes this low mileage uh, and it will include a new awning, of course. However you buy this coach, folks, it's going to include a new awning canvas, so don't worry about that. Whether you buy the as-is or the or the um, checked-out price, the option A price, it's, it will include an awning. $29.9 includes in this 51,000 miles, $290, uh, 5290 I should say, Gulfstream b and Cruiser, checked out, ready to go. This is just how it came in. We haven't done anything to it yet. Uh, after purchase, my RV techs are going to go through this thing. They're going to do a major component checkout on this RV, an extensive major component checkout. In other words, folks, we're going to check all the RV components, make sure they work like they're supposed to. We did drive it 250 miles up here, so obviously it runs and drives great. Um, came out, well, I think we got it out of South Carolina. Um, but... Uh, we will go through it, make sure everything works for that $29.9 price, and whatever we find that's on our list that does not function, we're going to repair it or replace it at no additional cost to you. In other words, folks, no matter what it costs us when this thing goes into the service area to get checked out, the price is still $29.9, and everything on that list will be functional at no additional cost to you. Also get a 90-day nationwide limited warranty for that $29.9 price. You also get 21 nights of free camping, up to seven nights at a time at select RV resorts nationwide. Very nice RV resorts. I've stayed at myself, uh, I might add. And more. Uh, plus you get a, a demonstration walkthrough by the RV check tech after it's been through service. He's going to show you how to operate everything. He's going to show you anything he had to do as far as repairs answer questions, give you tips, tricks, and pointers, and more. That's included for $29.9. You get a drive-out tag, a starter kit with your camping essentials like sewer hose, water hose, pressure reducer, uh, adapters, toilet paper, chemicals, and all that in a bucket. That's also included. 
and an instructional DVD as well. So you're definitely going to get everything you need to take it right to the campground from the lot for the option A haggle-free non-negotiable firm price of $29.9. The only way we discount our prices, folks, is if you take option B, which is you buy the motor home as it sets. We will put an awning canvas on it, but other than that, you buy it as it sets, just like it is in the video. You take the good with any potential bad. Um, now I've already I know the fridge works, the air works, the lights work. I think there's one or two that need bulbs, but other than that, and of course um, we drove it. There's no check engine lights, brake lights, none of that nonsense, and the slides work, and the generator works. But other than that, folks, there's still a lot more systems on this RV. I haven't checked out, and obviously at the option B price, you're taking those you're taking those uh, systems just like they are. If they work, they work. If they don't, they don't. It's up to you, and if you want to fix it, it's on your dime. That's what as is means, folks. As is has no exclusions. No matter what happens, as far as a motor home, the chassis, the running gear, whatever, if something's not right when you buy something as is, then it's you're responsible for 100% of the repair cost if you choose to repair it. Now, folks, I shouldn't have to tell you that, but I've had some people that are confused about what as is means. Um, you know, we sell it one of two ways. We either check it out, put a warranty on it for the $29.9 price, or we'll give you a discount, let you take it as is. It's kind of like going to Vegas and gambling, folks. It's a roll of the dice. It works out sometimes. Sometimes it doesn't. But you do get a discounted price, and you don't have to wait for it to get checked out. I mean, you can pick it up and take it home the same day you pay for it. Um, if you take the option B price or option A, after you pay for it, it goes in line to get checked out about a week and a half or so uh two weeks roughly we'll have it checked out for you and and my service manager will call you set up a time for you to pick it up and get your walkthrough demonstration and and of course then you go through the the rv tech's going to show you everything like i said earlier um or the option b you don't get anything you don't get a warranty you don't get a checkout you don't get an inspection you don't get a walkthrough you don't get camping you basically get the RV, a, a, a drive-out tag, a starter kit, and, uh, and and a DVD, and that's it, folks. So if you can buy it, knowing the conditions of the option B price, then we'll be happy to get you one. Contact your sales department. They're more than happy to get you a haggle-free option B price as well. You don't have to make the decision based on my video, folks. And I've said this and said this time and time again. A lot of truth to this. This is a 14-year-old used vehicle. It's in very nice condition for a 14-year-old used vehicle, but it is used. Now, this thing brand new is obviously uh, two and a half times this price. But this is used. It has some use on it. Don't buy something sight unseen. I do not recommend buying something sight unseen used. Come look at it. Let us know you're coming, of course, so we can make sure it's still available and uh, let you know if it's got a deposit on it or not because we can't hold anything without a deposit. So keep that in mind, folks. Call us right before you leave the house to come look at it to make sure it's still available. Just because it's on YouTube doesn't mean it's available. I never delete my videos. I've got videos going back to 2010. Today's July 24th, uh, 2018. So keep that in mind. These things don't sit long especially this price range with jacks, low miles, and this nice of condition. So please call ahead, make sure it's available. Um, I've sold RVs online in as little as 45 minutes after the video was published. All it takes is somebody to make a phone call with a credit card and it's off the market. Anyway, if you got any questions about that or if you want to make an appointment to come see it, let our salespeople know. Let them know you're coming. They'll they'll crank the generator up or hook it into power. Have the have it cooled off for you. Just give them plenty of notice to do that. Um, you know, try to give them 24 hours notice to do that if you want to, because it, it's very hot out here, folks. You don't want to stay in one of these very long without air. When it's 97 degrees outside, it's even hotter inside. But keep that in mind. Um, if you got any questions about this motor home. Our 24-7 answered sales number is 706-965-7929. During business hours, my salespeople answer it. During after hours, our, our, um, we have a um, call center that answers it that has basic information. If they can't help you, 
they'll get your information forward to our non-commissioned sales department. Folks, we've been in business for 50 years, since 1968, three generations family owned and operated. Folks, we're one of the oldest, largest, and most successful independently owned RV dealers in the United States, used RV dealers. We've got over 140 units in stock, all used, more arriving every day. And we've got the lowest prices on the internet, folks. Believe me, I look before I post every video and compare prices. I mean, for a 2005 290 with this kind of miles and jacks with a warranty, there's not a better deal out there for 299 even close to it. And this is 299 out the door. We're not like other dealers that after you make your deal, you get ready to sign on the dotted line and do your finance paperwork or, or write a check or however you're paying for it. And suddenly the business manager adds three or $4,000 in dock fees and prep fees and setup fees and tag and title fees and get ready fees and acquisition corporate fees or whatever they call them folks. All those fees are 100% dealer profit and 100% unnecessary to purchase a used RV or even a brand new one. The only thing you're required to pay, folks, is the sales price and applicable sales tax. And if you got a question about how much sales tax you will pay buying one from us, where and when you have to pay it, uh, contact your sales department. They'll get you that information. That way everybody's on the same page and you've got a total of what you need to bring to buy this camper or buy this motorhome. Financing's available with approved credit and minimum 10% down payment. Um, excuse me, folks. And you can apply for financing right from our website, parkwayrvcenter.com. You can have your trade-in appraised from our website, parkwayrvcenter.com. So anybody that's watching this video on YouTube, please click over to our website, parkwayrvcenter.com, and um, look this unit up there because you're going to see not only you're going to see the video that you're seeing now you're going to see specs you're going to see information you're going to see a factory brochure you're going to see a factory floor plan if it's available and more a lot more information than just going to youtube and again our website if you want to type it in is parkwayrvcenter.com or if you go to my youtube homepage click on the picture of the camper by the lake or look on the picture of the camper by the lake, the motor home by the lake, and it'll say our website. Click on that text and it'll take you right to our website. Very easy, folks. And we've got a great interactive website that I can't tell you how many hundreds and hundreds of unique visitors a day visit our website. It's absolutely staggering. And um, make sure you check it out. Save it to your favorites. You're going to see my inventory or, or more current inventory on there. I don't have everything listed online, folks, so please, if you don't see what you're looking for, uh, shoot our salespeople an email, sales at parkwayrvcenter.com, or give them a call at 706-965-7929. Tell them what you're looking for. They'll be more than happy to help you. If you need basic information answered, if you're on our website, we have a live operator chat system that's on our homepage of our website, as well as a text system for those of you who like to text, and they can get give you basic information and any detailed information or something they can't help you with, again, just like my call center, they will get a hold of, uh, get your information and send it to our sales team who will contact you the next business day. Uh, our salespeople are non-commissioned. Our prices are haggle-free and there's no extra fees. So that's three things everybody hates about buying a used RV or used any kind of vehicle that we eliminated years ago. Commissioned salespeople, haggling, and extra fees. That's one of the many reasons why we've been here for 50 years, why we've always been here for you and always going to be, folks. Family owned and operated since 1968, three generations. Working on number four um, and much more. If you've got any questions, again, our office number is 706-965-7929. Uh, please come look at this RV. Like I said, with any used vehicle you buy, you need to come look at it, spend some time in it, get to know it, drive it and then decide if you want to buy it and then decide if you want to do option A or B. I mean, it can't get any more fair than that, folks. So anybody watching this video, you're more than invited to come down to our dealership, look around. We're totally different than any of the big dealers you've been to before. You don't have to go through a sales office here to look at units. 
You know, you go to these big corporate dealers, you got to go inside a sales office. You can't just walk out on the lot because everything's locked up behind a, a prison yard, is what I call it. And they got six, eight foot, ten foot tall fence with barbed wire around the top. And the gates are locked. The only way you can get in there is if you've got a salesperson with a key. And the only way you're going to get a salesperson with a key at these big dealerships is if you go in, sit down in his office, give up all your personal information so he can bug the piss out of you if you don't buy from him. And uh, before he even lets you look at units. And then you're only going to look at RVs that he wants you or he or she wants you to look at, not the ones that you want to look at. It's a very common ploy, folks. And if you've been to these, some of these RV dealerships, all I ask you to do is don't judge us all by the actions of a few because we there are some good guys in this business. We're one of them, and we're not like that. You, during business hours, my units are unlocked. You can look at all of them as long as you want. You can look with or without someone. There's no problem, folks. Believe me. Uh, I have way more customers on the lot than I do salespeople, so if you don't want somebody to, to walk around with you, They've got no problem with that because there's plenty of other customers out here they can help too. Um, they're non-commissioned, so there's no sales pressure, no games, no gimmicks, no BS, no lies, no worries because they get paid the same whether you buy one from us or not. That's the way our salespeople prefer it because they know exactly how much money they're going to bring home every day to their or every week to their family. That's the way that our customers prefer it because they don't have to deal with all the haggling and all the stress and pressure of buying from a commission salesperson. Because a commission salesperson is always going to put their needs before yours because they get paid a percentage of the profit. So that means no matter what you want to look at, they're going to try to sell you the one that has the highest markup so they get the highest commission check. Kind of like they reward their salespeople for ripping you off when you go to a dealer with commission salespeople. So that's why we don't use them, folks. Now, I don't have 30 or 40 salespeople. I can't afford that many, but I still have four full-time salespeople that can help you out, folks. Anyway, if you got any questions, give us a call. Drop us an email. Thank you for watching my video. This is a nice B-Touring Cruiser. I think anybody would be proud to own, especially for this price. Like I said, financing is available with approved credit. Nationwide deliveries available. Um, and much more. We've sold RVs to customers from all 50 states. And yes, folks, I'm including customers that we have sold RVs to from Alaska and even Hawaii. So I don't care how far away you have to come to buy an RV. Chances are we have sold someone in your area an RV before. So you wouldn't be the first, trust me. You wouldn't be the first one from your area to buy one from us. Thank you for watching. Look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia. Hey folks, just want to add a quick thing to this video. Um, I let the fridge run for a few more minutes. And, or the freezer, I should say. 32 degrees. So just in a few minutes, it went from 55 to 32. So Now the fridge takes a few more hours, which I'm not going to wait on that. But um, it does work, folks. 99% of the time that the freezer works, the fridge works. It just takes the fridge several hours to cool off where the freezer is faster. Uh, that's just the way these things are designed, folks. Anyway, just thought I'd point that out. Thank you again for watching and, and look forward to seeing you in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.